Hello everyone, welcome back to my learning channel. Today we will see how to install Java on Ubuntu. Right now I am using Ubuntu 16.04 on my Oracle Virtual Box, so uh, which you can able to see here Ubuntu 16.04 which is running and on Oracle Virtual Box. Okay, so uh, let's start to installation process. So before installation, let me show you that uh, which uh, means Java is installed into my system or not. For that, I opened a terminal. Okay, and for checking the version, we have to use Java minus version. And you are able to see here that it, I'm getting message that like, like uh, the program Java cannot be found into the following packages. Okay, so what I have to do before installing, I have to first I have to update my uh, entire virtual machine, I mean entire Ubuntu system. So for that, the command is sudo apt get update. Okay, and it is asking my password of this, so I'm just giving the password. And it will take some time to uh, do the updation. So here you, you can able to see that uh, uh, my updateation is completed. Now after that, after updation, what I will do, I will I will just go and uh, use the default JDK installation for that sudo default JDK. Okay, and it will start. To checking the everything here it is asking me that uh, do you want to continue or not so i'm just want to continue so press y here so it will take some time so uh, after everything is done because this is the automatic process so we have to wait till uh, everything is done so here uh, my installation is completed then so just clear my screen okay and here we are going to check that after installing default jdk my version mapping is working or not so if I'm checking here Java minus version, so it is showing that Java JDK version 1.8.0.1 is software installation. What we have to do, we have to set the path of Java by which we can use it later. So uh, for setting the path, we have to first go and check the location. So for that, just click here to the files. Now go to the computer now user then after go to lib then go to jvm here go to java 8 open jdk amd64 now go to bin inside bin all the uh, commands and everything is there so just right click here go to properties and copy this okay now you can close it no problem for that after that sudo get it slash etc slash profile okay so this is my etc profile okay in, in at the last of this just what we have to do okay after saving file after close it okay after that we have screen and check once again java version so java version is fine and after that check java c means java compiler and it is working very fine so uh, that's all for that for the today's session thanks for watching this video please be with me for the next upcoming video for videos please subscribe my channel as well as share this video with others thanks